Obviously very important um, part of the Joint Task Force operational footprint is targeting of trucks that are tampered with for speed. We're seeing across 150,000 intercepts conducted by this group, 13% um, of those trucks tampered with for speed. We're going to focus heavily on speed tampering and trucks, you know, trucking companies that practice that competitive advantage behaviour. Obviously we're here today, 58 heavy vehicles have been inspected. We've found 20, evidence of 25 defects. Importantly, six, six critical breaches in that heavy vehicles carrying dangerous goods weren't properly placarded or carrying those products safely. Obviously, this is a significant concern. Um, also today, we've got a driver tested positive to methamphetamine, another driver driving disqualified, and yet another truck which has been tampered with for speed. Well again today we've seen the deployment of the Joint Traffic Task Force into a, another distribution centre to check compliance. Roads and Maritime and the New South Wales Police Traffic and Highway Patrol Command have been very clear with our message to industry. Load restraint, speeding trucks, poor loading practices, drug use and other behaviour leading to commercial advantages will not be tolerated. Those companies that make dangerous decisions for competitive advantage reasons, they can expect a visit by the Joint Task Force. We're here today, we're here today with another large company. You know, tomorrow there'll be another operation to run and we're across New South Wales broadly.